In this video, I want to quickly talk about sorting and formatting columns in React Table. At the moment, you can see that we have a date type column in our table. And surprisingly, sorting works even on the date column without us having to explicitly state that it is a date column. This is because our mock JSON in fact stores data in the ISO format. And this is really important. If you're working in a project and your API provides a string formatted date field, sorting would happen as if date column is a string field and not date field. So make sure the data you provide to the table is not already formatted. For example, in the DDMMYYYY format. Now you might ask me, well, I understand that React Table needs a proper date format as its input to support sorting. However, in the UI, this is definitely not what the user wants to see. What should I do about that? Well, it turns out React Table provides a simple way to format any column data. What we want at the moment is to format our date field. You could write your own formatting function, but I'm going to use the date functions package in this video. So back in VS Code in the terminal, run the command yarn add date hyphen FNS. The package is pretty straightforward to use, so you can read up on its docs when you have a few minutes to spare. We will only use one function from this package, so you don't have to worry much for this video. Once the package is installed, head over to columns.js file and at the top, import format from date functions. Format, as the name indicates, is a function which we use to format the date field. Now in the columns array on the date of birth field, we can add a new property called cell. This property controls what is rendered in the UI. The cell property is equal to a function. It receives a couple of things as its argument, but we are only interested in the raw value of the column. In our case, the ISO formatted date in the JSON. So destructure value, and then we return the formatted date. So return format, and the first argument to format is the value. And the second argument is the format in which we want the date to be displayed. This is ddmmyyyy. If we take a look at the mock JSON though, you can see that even though date of birth is ISO formatted, it is still present as a string value. So inside our format function, we need to convert the value into a date type. So new date and we pass in value. If we now save all the files and in the terminal run yarn start, you can see that the date of birth column is in a user-friendly format and the sorting still works as expected. So when dealing with date columns and sorting, make sure to preserve the date type when passing the data into the React table. For formatting, use the cell property for each column. You get access to the raw value of each row for that column and you can transform that value into any format desired. All right, that is about the sorting feature in React Table. In the next video, let's take a look at filtering. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.